My essay told me one item on my wish list has arrived, so I'm going to pick it up and take you with me to Hermes. I'll show you what I tried on. I'll include their price details as always. Let me know which one is your favorite and if you have gotten any quota bags so far this year. Let's get right into the video. It was so funny that day when I was browsing around and taking videos for you. A subscriber was also shopping in the same Hermes boutique. She recognized me even with my mask on and walked up to me, told me that she loves my shopping vlog. That totally made my day and I appreciated it so much. If you see me in the San Francisco boutique, feel free to say hi and I would love to chat with you in person. Hello, Gina. It was really nice meeting you and thank you for saying hi. Back to shopping. It feels that Hermes got a little bit more stuff after the new year since I was here last time. If you missed out my recent Hermes shopping vlog, I'll link the video down below for you to check it out after this video so that you can see the difference. This is their bag wall. You can see that majority of the bags that are on display here are men's bags. Onto the shoe section, I spotted quite some new spring arrivals like the Paris loafer in different colors. How fun are these new spring colors? Paris loafer is currently retail for $1,025. The royal loafer in the violet color is perfect for spring and it's currently retail for $1,050. I also spotted the white cross sneakers with the cute platform. The denim version is currently retail for $680. The low top day sneaker is $1,125 and the high top day dream sneaker is $1,250. I think I prefer the day sneaker with the gold Kelly buckle. How about you? On to the ready to wear section. I feel San Francisco Boutique has gotten more ready to wear pieces since I was here last time. Most of them on display here are in the big size. If you are interested in any of the ready to wear pieces, you probably wanted to act faster with your sales associate. At this point, I'm actually really interested in getting some ready to wear from Hermes for myself. Comparing to the women's collection for spring summer 2022, I personally feel that the men's collection feels more fun. Look at these men's collection style and color palette and I love the fun sweaters and the shirts. How fun is the reversible rib trim jacket in the yellow color? You can wear this jacket in both sides and it's currently retail for $3,625. I will show you my ready to wear try on in a bit. First, I tried on this long sleeve sweater with the round edge motif. It's in the 100% cashmere material and I'm wearing a woman's size 34 here which is my true size for Hermes ready to wear. It's also available in the black color but I think I prefer the black color more here. What do you think? The sweater is currently retail for $1,325. I also got to try on this long coat with the eyelid closure on the side. It has two pockets on the outside of the coat. This one I'm wearing is in size 38, which is way too big for me. The coat is in the double-sided 100% cashmere material. What's special about this coat is the color fastening with the lambskin eyelid closure. And you can wear the coat open or closed. It's also available in the black color, which I think I like more. It's a very cozy everyday layer for the San Francisco weather and the code is currently retail for $5,800. What do you think of this code? Leave me a comment down below to let me know. Remember I was telling you that I'm really into menswear this season? I'm considering getting this men's sweatshirt in the sweatshirt version and I'm trying on the hooded version here is because currently they only have this one in the men's medium size 
available. I think last time I tried it on a men's sweatshirt in the small size. It does fit me better, but the median oversized look is not bad either. The hooded sweatshirt is in the 100% cotton material and it's currently retail for $1,225 and it has the horse lambskin patch in the front of the sweatshirt. If I end up getting it, it'll be a different color, but do you think I should get a size small or the median, this one? Leave me a comment down below to let me know. By the way, I'm totally enjoying my sneakers here. Let's go take a look at the jewelry section. Here are some of the jewelry pieces that are on display right now and some watches pieces here. The Nantucket watches here are very feminine and pretty. Their prices are way higher than the regular Cape Cod watches. Can you see the Venus bracelet in the white gold and the rose gold version here? And the rose gold with diamond is $5,900 and the white gold with diamond is $6,300. The regular the H Dunkel bracelet had a small price increase and now it's $6,950. The diamond and rose gold H Dunkel ring is currently retail for $13,300. The white gold Cali pendant with diamond is currently retail for $7,100. On to the home section, there's some tableware on my wish list are still not available yet at this moment. My essay said nothing else that we can do other than just wait. It sounds like the quarterbacks on our wish list, right? I'm actually considering some pieces from St. Louis at this moment. Have any of you gotten any pieces from St. Louis before via your essay? How do you like them so far? Their crystal lamp, crystal cups, and vases are all really, really beautiful options. If you have any of them, I would love to hear your opinion in the comment below. Have you checked out my Hermes quota bag wish list in my luxury wish list 2022 video? I will link it down below for you to check it out after this video if you missed out that one. Leave me a comment down below to let me know if you like a dedicated video for me to discuss all my other Hermes wish list with you. I got to pick up my purchase from my essay. My essay also saved a Chinese red envelope for me. I will unbox what I got with you very soon. I hope you enjoy these eye candies and I'll see you soon. Bye bye!